Hey everyone, this is Dungeon RPG. It is great that the Nintendo Switch is made region free. It gives many of us an access to some otherwise Japanese exclusive games on the eShop. There are many good tutorials on how to create a Japanese Nintendo account, which people have made since its launch. In case you haven't done so already, I'll leave a few links in the description for you to check out on exactly how to do that. The problem, however, comes after you've made your Japanese region Nintendo eShop account. And yeah, you need to somehow put money into your eShop's wallet in order to buy games from there. There are a few ways people can do it. Number one involves getting eShop points cards, which basically is for you to buy Japanese region eShop point cards for online resellers and then redeem those codes on the eShop. This is probably the most commonly used method for people, but the downside is that first you often have to pay a considerable markup or higher price to the online reseller. And second, you can only buy the prepaid cards in whole amounts, such as 1,000, 2,000, and 5,000 yen. A second way is that the eShop allows for direct payment using credit card. This has the advantage of letting you pay the exact amount and cost of the game that you want to buy, so you don't end up with this leftover amount. However, as people quickly found out, the Japanese eShop on the Switch is very picky at accepting non-Japanese credit cards. Which means very likely, as most of you have tried already, the cards from our own country are not accepted in this way. And this leaves us with the third option, that Nintendo has recently updated to allow PayPal as an option for payment on Nintendo's eShop. To do this, however, you're going to need to have an original Japanese region PayPal account. And I'll walk you through exactly how to do this in this video. So before you start, you're going to need your own credit card for your own country that you plan on using for your PayPal. And then a spare email address that you wish to use as your new PayPal account to register. Go into your browser and type in paypal.gp to go to the Japanese PayPal website. And then click on the top right corner to register for a new account. Choose the first one, which is the personal account. You can leave the country Japan as it is and then enter the email address that you would like to use to register. For password, you're going to need at least 8 characters with upper and lower cases as well as one symbol. You can be creative here with your name, but for the birthday, it might be easier to remember if you use your actual birthday. And for the 7-digit zip code, anything that starts with 100 will give you the postal code of Tokyo, but you can also look up the postal code of your favorite place in Japan on Google. For the actual street number, again, you can be creative here. For the phone number, please input a 10-digit number that you will remember. And for all of the above information, if you already have a forwarding address with a proxy service in Japan, it will be easier for you to actually use those information. At this step, you can choose to input your credit card information now, or put the information in later. Now your account should be basically set up. Click on this button here to send an email to confirm your email address for your account. The email you get should look something like this. Click on this blue button and put in your password to sign in and verify. Now your account should be confirmed. Click on the third button here to input your credit card information if you haven't done that earlier. At this point, PayPal is going to place a small charge of about $2 onto the credit card that you put in. You're going to need to check your credit card statement in the next two days for this entry, and you're going to need those four digits in that entry there to confirm your credit card. And don't worry, PayPal is going to reverse the charge once your credit card is confirmed. And now your Japanese PayPal account is good to go. What you do is return back to your Switch, choose Nintendo eShop, and select the Japanese region Nintendo account. And then go to the top right corner, which is your profile, and click on this orange button right here to add balance onto your wallet. And choose the third option, PayPal. And click on this orange button here to get an email that lets you link your eShop account with your PayPal account. The email you get will be similar to this. Click on the first link. Sign into your Nintendo account. And press this button here to set your PayPal account. Now you want to sign into your PayPal. 
here you'll see the credit card information, make sure it's correct. If you see this screen, that means the linking process is complete. And if you have followed this guide, your Japanese Nintendo eShop account on the Switch will be activated with your newly created PayPal account as the funding option. And you can use that to purchase all the games that you want. So I hope this guide was easy enough to follow. If you have any questions, please leave them down in the comment section below. Thanks for watching Dungeon RPG and happy gaming!